Hello. In this video, we will look at the function of IS7 lost command. The VFD exchanges information with the host controller. The VFD receives the command from the host controller and drives the motor. There may be a problem that causes communication between the host controller and the VFD. The main causes of communication problems are noise generation and cable connection. If a communication problem occurs, the input signal from the VFD is lost. When a VFD cannot transmit an output signal to a load, it is called a lost command. Therefore, the lost command mode is used to minimize production loss caused by command loss. Five different modes are available for lost command. In free run mode, the VFD cuts off the output and the motor comes to a stop by freewheeling. Decel mode stops the drive by reflecting the deceleration time set in the VFD. Hold input mode operates with the speed command input until the speed is lost. That is, the VFD calculates the average speed input value for 10 seconds before the loss of the speed command and uses it as the speed reference. Hold output mode operates with the speed command output until the speed is lost. In other words, the VFD calculates the average output value for 10 seconds before the loss of the speed command and uses it as the speed reference. Lost preset mode operates at the frequency set in PRT14 when lost command occurs. The lost command mode can be set using four parameters. It consists of PRT12 lost command mode, PRT13 lost command time, PRT14 lost preset frequency, and PRT15 AI lost level. PRT12 lost command mode has six parameter options. It consists of 0 none, 1 free run, 2 decel, 3 hold input, 4 hold output, and 5 lost preset. You can set the time for PRT13 lost command time. Set the lost command time from 0 0.1 to 120. If the command loss continues for the time set here, it is determined as a lost command. PRT14 lost preset frequency sets Hertz to operate when speed command is lost. It is used when PRT12 is programmed to 5 lost preset frequency. PRT15 AI lost level sets the analog input level. PRT15 AI lost level sets the analog input level. When the range of analog input signal is between 4 mA and 20 mA, half of X1 protective operation starts when the input signal is reduced to half of the initial value of the analog input set using the speed command and it continues for the time set at PRT13. Below X1 starts the protection operation when the signal is smaller than the minimum setting of analog input, that is, 4 mA signal, is maintained after the PRT13 lost command time elapses. Let's program and test the lost command operation. Program the DRV6 operation command to 1FXRX1 by pressing the mode key and direction key. Program DRV7 operation frequency command 
two, three. Program PRT12 Lost Command Mode to Lost Preset Number 5. When PRT12 is set, parameters 13 to 15 are activated. Program the PRT13 Lost Command Time to 2 seconds using the arrow keys. The Lost Command Time can be set from 0.1 to 120 seconds. Enter PRT14 and set lost preset F to 20 Hz. When a lost command occurs, operation continues at the frequency set in this parameter. When the AI lost level of PRT15 is set to below X1 to receive analog input between 4 and 20 milliamperes, if it is below 4 mA, it will switch to lost command mode. When the operation command P1 terminal is turned on, the VFD starts forward operation. Currently, the VFD is operating in the forward direction of 60 Hz. The transducer is connected to the analog input terminal I1 and is operating. The analog current input is lost when the wiring of I1 is disconnected. The VFD switches to lost command mode two seconds after the command is lost. After the lost command, you can see that it is driving at 20 Hz set as the lost preset frequency. This is how the function for lost command mode operates. Thank you.